Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you this type of norm orange type modern orange and preset which is for the Photoshop and Lightroom. So I have some stock image. I'll provide you that download link in my video description for the practice purpose and let's start the tutorial. If you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. So going to the file and here this image I'll insert in my Photoshop this one drag and drop press ctrl or command j you will get another copy of this layer or you can drag it and drop in this plus sign and after that going to the filter and camera filter so this one is another plugins of the photoshop if you want to get the download link of this camera 13.0.2 or update link please check out my video description this is very similar with the lightroom and you can just have visual with that if you use this one two or three days from here you are getting the load settings options norm orange and load it up so after adding this one you are getting the drastical change or instant change in this photo and what is the setting let's see here the temperature plus 4 and 10 0 and the exposure 0 0 contrast 0 and highlights that is minus 68 and the shadow plus 71 and the whites plus 42 and the blacks that is minus 3 and the texture plus 35 and the clarity plus 27 and the dh is 0 here the vibrance minus 10 and the saturation minus 17 in the basic portion we are done in a curves portion here use the, here the rgb tone curve the input value is 0 and output value 34 input value 45 and output value 42 input value 116 and output value 102 input value 198 and output value 180 and input value 255 and output value 242 here the detailing option the sharpening plus 33 and the noise reduction 17 and color noise that is 18 so two types of noise you have to be careful when you are using the noise reduction if you use it more this image will be changed or the quality will be down the color getting before that color mixing three things hue saturation luminance hue which color will be saturation the percentage of the color and luminance that is the intensity of the color hue the red hue plus 25 and the orange hue minus 13 yellow minus 60 and the green plus 62 aqua plus 69 and the blue minus 20 that's why you are getting a little bit this type of aqua color the saturation percentage of the color red percentage 19 orange percentage minus 19 yellow minus 9 green minus 2 and the aqua plus 64 blue minus 27 and the purple plus 16 magenta plus 24 that's good in the luminance options you are getting the intensity of the red plus 58 orange plus 66 and a yellow plus 62 here the green plus 28 and aqua minus 22 and blue plus 15 that's good the color getting the shadow color here the zero percent and the saturation that is 15 in the mid-tone portion the color of the coat that is 209 and the saturation 28 and the highlights that is 67 actually 76 and the saturation 22 that's good and the optics and geometry i didn't use the effects minus v 11 for the vignetting and here the mid-tone 50 and the feather 50 and here the calibration the calibration value of the red that is plus 52 and the saturation plus 8 in a blue primary color minus 57 for the hue that's all and hit the ok button you're getting the hues change before and after and after that if you want or if you're interested to add another plugins or another filter you can do that going to the filter and here the neat collection and color effects pro 4 this one is another plugins of the photoshop if you want to get the download link please check out my video description and here lots of preset actually a bunch of preset and the filters you can use one of them here using the cross processing and which one is perfect for your photography you can choose l03 is good for me and hit ok and it will take time to provide the final output by adding these effects so you can manage the fill or opacity from here you're getting the change the before ordinary normal image and after you're getting the tone which is the moody brown or moody orange or norm orange whatever you can tell 
So hope that you learned a lot from this video. If you did, please thumbs up and share with your friend. And if you have any kind of question, query request, please do comment on my video comment section. Until the next video, I am A7 signing out today. Stay safe, stay at home, keep me in your prayers as well. Bye-bye.